Good morning, my beautiful lovelies. It is the beginning of a new week. And this week for clinicals, I am at a maternal fetal medicine facility for OB. So I've only seen probably like three or four exams of OB so far ever. So now I'm going to the extreme of all high-risk pregnancies. So we're going to see how that goes. I personally do not love OB, but that is okay. That is the whole point of the medical field. Everyone falls into the place that they love. So it ends up working out. I just really enjoy abdomen work. That's what I like. I'm really uncomfortable with OB because I haven't done any. And we just started learning it last week officially learning like second third trimesters and taking uh, anatomy measurements on our phantom which was really cool to do glad that we have phantoms because it's helped me the most and yeah so i'm gonna try to take you guys with me today or at least try to update you guys in the bathroom on my breaks so that i'm not you know getting in trouble or anything and I'm excited, I'm nervous, I'm a little scared, but you know how that goes. It's just meeting new people, going to a new place, but I'm gonna go in there and be the happy person that I am and just wanna learn whatever they are willing to teach me. So that is today. fine my hair's pulled back I look neat and professional and then we're gonna walk in I'm excited ah I'm happy to take you guys with me let's go talk to you guys so whenever I go grab a patient I always tell them my name introduce myself hi my name is Brooke I am a uh, sonography student and I'm going to be starting your exam and then I check their wristband and then I check with the paper and I also check with the ultrasound machine to make sure that they all match because seeing them give the wrong wristband but everything else is correct so I check all three so after I do that, I check the birthday and their name, blah, blah, blah. And then I say, okay, as soon as I am done scanning, someone's gonna scan after me just to make sure I didn't miss anything. If they say that looks good, then you're free to go. It won't take them much longer at all to scan after me because sometimes they're in a rush and they don't want you to scan. But I always tell them like, our sonographers are a lot faster than me. You know, it'll probably only take you about another five or 10 minutes, depending if they see anything and then you can go and they're usually okay with that. I have not had any issues and I went through two years of x-ray and then another year of ultrasound and no one has ever told me no as a student, which is lovely because I need to learn and they let me, so that's good. So yeah, that's usually what I do. I make sure I have the entire room ready and stocked before I go get my patient and that's just personal preference. I've seen some people make the bed while the patient is in the room. I like to get started. That's more time for me to scan before my tech comes in. So yeah, that's what I like to do. Well guys, it's gone great so far. I still do not like OB. I don't think this is the job for me. Um, it is very busy. You're scanning. Oh, a baby was born. <laughs> you're scanning for like 45 minutes to an hour straight and your arm is just killing you. And I've uh, seen some very sad things today as well. It's just not for me. Table, the little 
the camera is on. Put it down. And this is the machine. Very high tech. I haven't used one like this before, but I really like it. Sorry for the terrible lighting, but I am in the parking garage and I wanted to go over what I usually see in a typical day at my OB site. So here, all of these pregnancies are high risk, so they come in once a week or every two weeks. Uh, a lot of them are every week, so we do a lot of BPPs. So that is by physical profile. So we're checking the baby's movements, we're checking if they're doing like practice breathing, uh, we're checking heart rate, and then we're just gonna check overall anatomy as well. Typically they go to our clinic and do a stress test afterwards. So that is, we see that a majority of the day. And then we also have a lot of anatomy scans and I actually just saw um, twins. So that was super exciting to see today. And I really do like seeing the anatomy scans and how fast they can really get them done. And they just know which side of the body is the left and the right, like so fast. I have to go back and look at the stomach and the heart to make sure I'm on the left side. But they're just so quick. They've been doing it for 10 plus years. And I just started last week. So I have no idea compared to them. They are so good. And I just, it's crazy. So those are a majority of the things I see in a day is anatomy scans and BPPs. So I just thought I'd hop on here and tell you guys that. And yeah. Okay guys, I am home now from clinical and my goodness was it a very overwhelming and an emotional roller coaster of a day. I do not know how these people go from one room where the mom is going to find out she's losing her child to the next room where it's their first ever pregnancy and super excited within the matter of like five minutes. I really don't know how they do it. It was very hard for me and I just I really don't enjoy it and there's nothing wrong with that. I'm not trying to come across as negative because some people may love it, but please know that ultrasound is not just scanning babies all day long. There is so much more than OBGYN, maternal fetal medicine, there's vascular, there's general, which is the one that my heart truly loves. So I went in with an open mind, but yeah not for me but that's fine i only have four weeks here and then hopefully i'm done all together with ob that would be great i could do it every once in a while but not every day no. <laughs>